fellow guardians of the Destiny Beta, I bring up to you 10 Crucible Commandments to help you wreck of the shop. So let's get it. The first commandment is thou shalt share the heavy ammo. Anytime you pick up heavy ammo and a friendly player is within touching distance of you, he also receives heavy ammo. So instead of racing for the crate, meet your friendlies at the crate, pick up the ammo, and everybody goes home with the rocket launcher. Good luck to the other team. The second commandment is thou shalt go Rambo. Rockets are powerful heavy weapons, but I ask you, consider a weapon with 100 rounds in the magazine and an insane killing speed. The machine gun is more versatile than a rock launcher, and it comes with more ammo so you can polish off more kills, much to your enemy's dismay. The third commandment is thou shalt simply ram the bastard. When you're an interceptor on interceptor combat, shooting is for stupids. Hit the boost button, make sure that you're lined up with your opponent and you'll go through him like a hot knife through butter. You'll receive a scratch on the paint. Don't worry about it. The fourth commandment is the radar shall betray you. There is a radar. It is annoying. But crouching will slow down how often you ping on the radar, and standing still will take you off the radar completely. It's like aliens, except your radar shows off all the scrubs. The fifth commandment is the auto rifle. Use it. Auto rifles have the best time to kill in the game right now. I recommend a mix of stability and rate of fire, so you're looking for weapons like the Galahad V, the Sidonia AR-3, or the practically broken Shingen C. That leads us directly into the sixth commandment. Thou shalt utilize the hip fire damage bonus. You heard me right, there's a hip fire damage bonus in this game. When you see your enemy start firing from the hip, as soon as you land two or three shots, aim down the sights and finish off the kill for best results. Repeat for only. Commandment number 7, your supercharge is not a panic button. Every time you kill an enemy with a supercharge, he generates an orb of light that your teammate can collect to speed up the cooldown of their own supercharge. That means the more guys you get with your supercharge, the more orbs of light there are for your teammates to gobble up Pac-Man style. If you coordinate this, you can all be supercharged all the time. Commandment number 8 is turrets are not invulnerable. The clear shield in front of their faces can be shattered with a few well-placed sniper rounds and then there's nothing guarding their stupid turret using head. Commandment number 9 is Thou Shall Play For Kills. The control game mode is not identical to the domination game modes you're used to from other games. Instead the flags net some points but mainly serve to multiply the points you receive from getting kills. Any scrub who thinks it's okay to cap flags in dial game needs to head for the hills. The final commandment is the hardest to utilize but the most rewarding when you get it right. Thou shalt pick your battles in the Crucible. You cannot play Destiny's PvP like you do other games. Charging in usually ends in disaster or death for a lot of different reasons. Instead you need to fight smart and not hard. Make your enemies come to you, set ambushes, play with the radar, and always fight your fight on your own terms. Your grenades are not just grenades. They all have an AOE option and that's for a reason. You can use them to slow down pursuers, you can use them to move your opponent to where you want him to go. You need to think before you act in this game, it's not a twitch shooter. That's the most important lesson that you can learn about Destiny's PvP. And for the good little boys and girls that watch the video and don't yet have beta access, I am going to post 5 beta codes in the video here. Be cool, and when you take a beta code, post in the comments what code you redeem so nobody else wastes their time. Thanks for watching the video. If you liked it, hit the like button. If you got something to say, hit a comment. If you want to subscribe, I appreciate that. I got more videos coming to cover Destiny and other games, so keep it locked to this channel. I'll see you guys in the next video, and as always, peace out.